inside expanded on the stuff that I wasn't interested in in Limbo, which was like the, the lore, you know, because that game is almost entirely because with Limbo, it's like it's it's like raw ish emotion, right? Like very rarely do you look at the big spider in the game. I don't remember ever looking at the big spider in Limbo my casual playthrough and actually i've got the entire casual playthrough on youtube maybe i should watch it just to see but i don't think there was ever a point where i was like oh man this big spider i wonder what it literally means in this world where it literally comes from i mean the game exists entirely as a metaphor and that's that's fine we will watch that that was a that's five years ago now i'm pretty sure but um You just sort of experienced the game and you were like, oh, that was cute. That was a cool puzzle. Oh, geez, that was... There was never anything that was too hard. But it still managed to be like... You didn't need to skill check on shit in Limbo. There was never any point in Limbo. We had to be super smart to figure something out. You know. Maybe, maybe I don't remember. It's entirely possible that if you watch my Limbo playthrough... I know there was definitely parts where I got pissed at myself and blamed it on the game. I, I knocked over a drink when I got jump scared a couple of times in that game. But um, I definitely wouldn't blame that on the game now. But the, yeah, the, the my problem with Inside is it's there's it's gross there's there's shit in the inside that's just gross and uh you know it's just it's just fucking whack um and it seems to be much more obviously building towards something it goes without saying in a gilly playthrough playing the game <laughs> it's it's a it's a reflex that i'm trying to get over because it it really isn't helpful gonna be fast. Okay. That was pretty good. I'll take that. <laughs> Damn. damage? I don't care. Okay, a little bit of a sticky exit. That's okay. That's a big difference. Yeah, but do you always do it while laughing and having a good time? Exactly. Um, there's some games where it's definitely like, this game fucking blows and I'm, I'm sick of it, etc. I never, I never know how to quit a game, which is, uh, that's a hard one. Because it always feels like there's definitely going to be, like, something that's going to make things worth it. Like, me rage quitting Outer Wilds, probably the first time I've ever done that. Do I feel kind of bad about it? Yes. But I don't feel bad about it to the game deserving anymore. I feel bad about it because one of my friends hasn't talked to me since. <laughs> I think... I think I really pissed them off by doing that. Which is unfortunate.
Now I've actually made it into here without dying, so that's good. Oh god, come on. Wow, this is a really good run, actually. <laughs> Holy shit! <laughs> I did not, I did not expect minus eleven coming into here. <laughs> oh my god. Um, I mean, uh, I'll take it. We're, we're on PB pace. Um, I definitely still have opportunities to mess this up. That's okay. Messing up is learning, and which is, that's another one that's really hard for me to realize. Is that every time I make a mistake, it's much more likely that I'm not gonna make that mistake again. You know? Oh yeah, it resets the zoom. That's funny. That's something that we've learned today, folks. Resets the zoom. The semi splits way down to the bottom. <laughs> yeah, we're on our way. We're on our way to, to something cool. Depends depends how well I pull off this ending bit, but uh, we'll see. Oh, yep. Rough three sec. Okay. We're on our way to something good here, I think. Not a world record, but <laughs> all right. Oh my God! I golded again. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God! sub nine we did it <laughs> i did it yay um i kind of wish that i had gotten a sub eight 
50. But <laughs> that's her next goal, I guess. <laughs> um, wow. Um, I've only been streaming for 30 minutes. <laughs> That was, uh, that was pretty good. Um, yeah, I lost like four seconds on the ending, but that's okay. The ending is really hard for me because I don't get enough practice. That's a good one. That's a good one. I have, I have a lot of time I can still save. But... I did it. Um... I don't know what my eventual goal is now. Where can I save? I'm gonna have to do like split comparisons to see like if I could get within two seconds of this person who's really good. Or five seconds or however the length of the split works. What would be a reasonable thing for me to get? Um, some of best segments currently points to sub 840, but that would be me working within my personal perfection and uh, even if i got 704 to atp um that'd be saving another eight seconds that takes me down to like an 830 so maybe sub 830 is asking <laughs> asking a lot but i think I, there's like still strats that i have to learn so. I mean, I'll do a couple more runs, but I, I, uh, I terrifically doubt I'm going to get anything much better than this. Yay! This is really good, actually. An 850, an A51 slaps. It's not bad. Where does that put me, uh, on the, on the leaderboards? The ultimate leaderboards. I don't terrifically care about my ranking on the leaderboards, but it is, it is, it would be... Maybe maybe my goal should be top 10. How hard would top 10 be? Sub 840, huh? Wait a second. Wait a second. I do recognize somebody on these leaderboards. I do recognize somebody on these leaderboards. After all this time, Artesial! I know who Artesial is! <laughs> uh, just like that, I like the game. <laughs> yeah, you got me. No, uh. I mean, how far away am I from top 10? Because that would be a funny thing to get. I'm 15th. Oh man, I, I literally put in all this work to, to get ahead of one person. Um, okay, I do recognize Artesial. She's a, she's a super liminal runner. I did commentary for a tournament set for her, and I actually bought some of her music on Bandcamp. I have no idea who the fuck Blankets is. <laughs> and then, yeah, Osikorchis. Portal, yeah, fucking, I'm 15. I'm in 15th place. I'm, I'm 37. No, um, I'm 24. <laughs> but I am in 15th place on the leaderboards right now, and I, I think with a lot of work, I could, I could get sub eight. My sum of best segments point to as much. So I guess the question is. Where can I save a lot of time? I don't know. Yeah, you made 15th. <laughs> Good day here. So I, I am now officially top 15. I think I'd like to get to top nine, 10. Top 9. Yeah, I fuck Napo in particular. <laughs> uh, yeah, no, it's actually really good. I don't... When did I start running this game? <laughs> I don't remember. Maybe a month ago? <laughs> How dare you? I said top nine and I meant top ten. I don't I don't know. It is hard to cut off seconds. It took me a lot of work to cut off nine seconds here. 
but at the same time, I mean, I'm gonna have to do a splits comparison against like, uh, like blankets. Maybe we should watch like blankets run and see how can I demolish blankets? Not demolish. How can I? How can I eke out a victory against blankets? Maybe that's the maybe that's the strategy. Or maybe I compare to PT Mensker and say, well, I'm going to lose four seconds here and lose three seconds here. Uh, some of the best segments barely makes it possible, but that involves having some, in my opinion, sick intro, intro splits where it's like a 102. That's very difficult for me to achieve. Um, I mean, I got the stock standard, which was like a 104, 105 next to, <laughs> next to entrance of ship, so... And I think like my 102 was not quite in the perfect position to enter the ship. So, but yeah, um, that's good.